here we go. I need to sort this garage out, it's an absolute state. And I need to get working on this, because that is a massive state. Right, first things first, obviously I need to load my car up. But today, we're gonna be, is that gonna stay? No, I think it should stay there. So today, we're gonna be playing Graffiti Piece Roulette. I just thought about it last night. I'm sure it's been done before, but yeah, I want to give it a crack. Um, so I'm going to stay with the colours that I was going to use last week, but I didn't use them because the wall was soaking wet, so I didn't even bother trying to paint. Um, I'll insert a little clip here of when I did try to paint the wall that was wet last year, last winter. And as you can see, it really didn't go very well. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna stay with the same colors. It's gonna be simple chrome fill, blue sort outline, and drop shadow, and bits and bobs like that. Um, I've got some other colors which I can use for doing some little bits and pieces. Um, so yeah, that's basically it. We'll get to the wall, and we'll see which style of piece I'm gonna paint. So here we go, what I was hoping is the wall is dry, and it is dry. Perfect. It looks like someone's bailed on a piece. Or they just had chrome and barely any black, I don't know. But it looks like it was all running down the wall. So the wall was probably soaked. They probably did it yesterday or like last night or something. Maybe not last night, but yeah. Another piece trashed by some kiddies. Which is the same down there. It's really nice production. And it's been trashed by kiddies. But anyway. Back to the video. It's supposed to rain today, that's why I got undercover here. Although, if it rains really heavily, there will be a couple of little streams that come down from the top, which is unfortunate. Um, anyway, right, let's brighten up the screen a bit. So, the idea of this graffiti piece roulette. Because I did such a poor job of recording the process in which this graffiti sketch roulette works, I will explain to you right now. So I'll film it better and you'll get the idea. So what I do is I sketch in my sketchbook, pencil, pen, rubber, all that stuff, just very conventional. Uh, I take a photo with my phone and then I just take my phone to the wall and I've got the sketch on my phone, simple as that. Um, so basically here I've got an album of all of my sketches that I've done, I don't know, over the last period of time, goes back quite a while. Um, so let's bring that back. Um, so basically I just shut my eyes, scroll through randomly, don't know which one I'm going to pick, and then I picked one, that one, that's the one I actually picked in this video. Um, so yeah, there you go, simple as that, it's just a random sketch that I've done. Um, yeah, and that's what I tried to paint. You'll have to wait until the end until you see how it comes out. But anyway, whilst I've got you here, subscribe to my channel, um, do that now, I'll put a little link in the corner. And yeah, I hope you enjoy the rest of this video. We'll scroll up and then hit a random tile. That's what I've got. Okay, so that's what I'm working with. Cool, that's a pretty good one. So yeah, happy with that. And I did have my eyes closed, so. Right, time to get this wall mulched up. problem chrome over wet mulch is not good it just soaks in which is definitely not good 
All right, rather than going with the chrome, we're actually going to go and do a little bit of a run the outside, get rid of that shit. Fail. Give them all slightly more time to dry. Right, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I think this uh, graffiti roulette thing could really work. If you're getting a little bit bored of your current sketches, current piece that you're painting, and you want to kind of uh, revive some old piece that you used to paint and kind of give them a modern twist, then why not give it a go? Use your old sketch as a guide. And um, yeah, you can come up with something new, fresh and funky. Um, I like to revisit old sketches. Um, I'm usually not that happy with a lot of the pieces that I paint and yeah, kind of going back with fresh eyes with what you've learnt in the meantime from when you first came up with that piece, that style that you used to paint, um, kind of lets you give it kind of more of a modern twist. Um, I kind of don't know what I'm going on about right now, so um, I'm going to leave it here. Um, if you haven't subscribed, then uh, please subscribe and uh, give this video a thumbs up and drop a comment. Tell me what you think about this graffiti roulette idea. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.